hi guys and welcome to another video so let's get started so in this video i'm gonna uh, continue talking about the directory directory class in c sharp so i'm gonna I'm just gonna get started by doing something here so there's lots of ways in which you guys can use the class so the first thing i'm gonna do here is to create a let's create a string array let's call ders which is going to be equal direct dot get directories and I'm gonna pass the C drive okay the C drive let's use a for each loop here war tor dir in dirs uh, and let's bring that director name out so you guys can use this to loop through directories in c-sharp let's start um, you guys can see these are all my folders in the c drive so okay, you guys can see here uh, i have some portuguese here because my windows was initially installed in uh, in portuguese so you guys can see these folders you guys can use this to loop through folders um, another one which is quite the same but it's actually a little bit different is the instead of get files let's change this let's actually change this a lot so let's you you can use directly the for each uh, loop for uh, string file string file and directory dot get files and we're gonna pass actually I'm gonna pass um, C dot let's pass the folder windows I probably would get an exception here because I don't have access to that folder but let's see if that's gonna happen actually I can see some files uh, these files I have access okay of course there are more a lot more files in that folder but these are the ones that I can access pro publicly. So you guys can see that you can use this to list uh, files and you could do whatever you want to them. You could compress and delete, uh, copy, uh, and lots of things. So you guys can see here, AMD, okay. So thank you guys for watching this video. Of course, we're gonna be talking about more of this in the near future, okay? so. Thank you again, see you guys next time.